You know, I like. Know. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta sell cool. You're gonna figure that out. I'm gonna stop you, you're gonna turn that down on mine, and I might not. Wait. Uh, let's, let's have to, okay, I know what I'm doing. Who doesn't like a little dance party in the morning? Okay, move over to Facebook audio. They're gonna use it. You got me on Facebook? Or FaceTime? FaceTime? Are you there on FaceTime? Do you have FaceTime? I'm muted. I'm muted my sound on my computer so that I can just see the countdown. But uh, anyway, so it's a little back channel here. So you can still get the music, but... Are we, are we like on? <laughs> well, we're gonna be, you're like hearing it. I think they're hearing it. I think they're hearing us in the background. And we like to have 46 seconds to, you know, to get our life together. I think that's what it comes down to. I think... I don't know. I gotta get a new mug shot. I gotta get a new mug. Okay. Oh, you do. It doesn't fit you. I like the beard, man. I like the beard. Your hair is miserable, but that, but the beard, the beard looks good. I can make not gray yet either. I think that's coming. Little, little, uh, gray. Gray. Good time is coming. Okay, so here we go. I think we're going. I think we're live on. I don't even know if we're live on my. Two, one. Okay, are we there? Are we hey. there? I've, I've got you. I've got you cranking out here. Love I'm it. Here. Oh, there it is. Yeah, beautiful. Good hey, morning. Good morning. Uh, well, here we go again. Shout out Monday. This Shout out Monday. I do. We have no clue what we're doing except we're two ordinary guys that just love God and love people. And they need some encouragement. So we're shouting out encouragement to your universe. Wherever like shouting, like like with, with a tremendous amount of volume. Like no, 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 you no, no. are encouraged. Well, you like, like that? Me. Yeah, do that. <laughs> you should do that. Uh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it by what do you call it when you compound? We're gonna compound the, the gratitude and thanks by other people doing it, and it will sound so freaking loud because of them joining. So, right. As we start, I want to hear what's going on with you a little bit. And we have friends that will be popping on here for Facebook and listen to it later. But I want to know, um, well, before I ask, let me just say, I got a little thing here. Just remind what we're doing, what we yeah, are Yeah, tell us doing. what we're doing, John. Tell, tell the people what we're doing. We are. Um, we're trying to figure out how to use this medium of Facebook or other mediums in order to be an encouragement. Uh, you know, we're a little sunshine into the day when the corona fog has set in and it has set in it's tough for people uh it's settled into our homes our schools churches faith communities but this the only thing that we want to do is that we want to help you that's right you uh to be able to have a little encouragement in your life and uh we're finding that it, it that gratitude man when it builds and we're sharing with other people it's awesome and uh i want i love getting encouraged and i love the encouragement to other people and so if we can just use this medium to do it. And so the goal is, thanks to you, Tom, uh, I was saying to do videos, which I still think we, I want to do. We want to do like a 10 second video. You can just get on your phone, 10 second video and say, I'm grateful for blah. And we'll give examples of that. But you gave baby steps. What were those last week you said they could do? Because you're so nice. You're full of grace. I'm well, nice, it's, so. you know, and it really went along with, uh, with what about Bob and baby steps to the elevator. Right. Um, and just, you know, the, not everybody's comfortable on video. You know, I mean, not everybody's just real comfortable about, about I mean, we live in a selfie culture. Well, not we everybody up. has video face like we do. Yeah. I mean, I mean, we got video beards. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. You don't even have to have a beard to do this. Um, but, but the goal is, is that yeah, the 
that you can take a little video and thank somebody, but then maybe you're not ready for video. Maybe you're not ready for that yet. And so you can just go on and you can type and you can tag them in and say, you know what? I really appreciate this about this person. And then, you know, maybe that will encourage them to reciprocate or to, you know, thank someone else or appreciate someone else. Because I, I think of a quote, I think it was Doug Fields that once said, you know, that, that affirmation is food for our soul. And in our society, we are starving. <laughs> and, um, and so I just think about that. And I'm like, how can this be something that is encouragement and food for people's souls? And that's what I love about Shout Out Monday, you know? And, you know, Sunday's always been the day where it's like Sunday fun day, right, John? I mean, you've heard of that, hashtag Sunday fun day. No, no, no. This Monday on. fun day. The Bengals got it wrong. It's not Manic Monday. It's, it's not Manic. It's <laughs> manic monday uh okay so we're gonna give examples of that right we're gonna help out and i want to start out by saying i just want to affirm you your beard looks good thank you beard. put the cup up again though the cup see people that don't know res gen ministries and tom has kind of always had look at that he's always had kind of the mustache with the little you know crumb catcher there at the bottom yeah. and uh <laughs> but you are looking you're looking good. I mean, you look not just South Dakota good, but well, you look you look good. And and here's the deal: like uh, it was a little brisk this morning, and mm -hmm. so I figured this is probably the last time that I'm going to be wearing the flannel and the vest. And I think with the, the last beard, time for it, what? It, the last time for what? Like ever? But, uh, no, like for this season, because you know it's going to get to be summer in South for Dakota eventually. In South Dakota, yeah. So basically, you're wearing that sweat that thing for a month. Because you're not going to live in South Dakota. Because I live in South Dakota, but but our restaurants, a lot of our restaurants reopened this week. So you asked how we're doing in South Dakota. Really? Yeah. yeah. So tell and me. So, so we've got a couple yeah. minutes, and we're going to give some example. I tell me how things go in South Dakota. How are you doing? You got a graduation coming up, by the way. I got the invitation. Well, yeah. yeah, my son. My son is graduating high school. You know, yeah. so we're going to have a little drive-through open house uh, for him. There. But mm -hmm. you know what? We're um, for the bike trails are full uh, with people exercising. The mayor gave a hundred, a hundred miles in a hundred days challenge, just challenging uh, the, cool. the people of Sioux Falls to saying, Hey, you know what? Yeah. We're connected to tech. I mean, obviously with, with work and Netflix and all that kind of stuff, but you know, get out and enjoy the weather bike, uh, walk around, you know, connect, um, you know, appropriately, but get out and like be healthy and stuff. And so I think that that's really um, been a good thing think for Sioux Falls a lot of people are doing that um and I think that with the baby steps there are some people that are that are that are nervous about the city kind of opening up and that's understandable yeah uh, there's others that are very excited we Laura and I went out for dinner um you know this weekend and uh we just went and, and supported one of our our favorite restaurants and ate in the cool. restaurant and so it's in the, the restaurant was open you could eat inside yeah. Yep. And so it was just cool. limited, limited to 12 tables, reservation only, uh, you know, the, uh, the servers all had masks on and it was just really good to just to be out and to support. Uh, Cause as you know, I mean, businesses is hard. I mean, restaurants are have slim margins anyway. It's a, it's a challenge. Yeah, it is a so. challenge. Totally. Well, and we're on West coast, you know, I'm on, uh, you know, in Portland area in Oregon city outside of Portland. Uh, we were in Portland yesterday and we, you know, we, we did, we've been trying to do takeout, did mama mother's day. Oh yeah. Takeout Chinese and that, but, but we're starting to see it happen, but I'll be honest with you. It's, it's quiet. Like the freeway yesterday, we did a little hike, a mother's day hike on it, the freeway. Yeah, we on the freeway. Cause there's no cars. We live in Oregon. It's beautiful. Everywhere it is go on the freeway. So we marched on the freeway. It was amazing. No, not really, but we went hiking forest park, but the traffic, and can I say, oh my gosh, I know our time's run out. We're supposed to keep 10 minutes. I could go forever. It's hanging with you. <laughs> but I will tell you that uh, it was crazy quiet. And it made hmm. me, I'll be honest, even in a Highlander, I wanted to go 120 miles an hour because yeah. it was like, there were just no people. And I'm like, this is not right. I should yeah. be going fast, but yeah, was I wasn't driving. So for <laughs> we did it. But uh, anyway, um, yeah, well, things, gonna, things are getting you know we're seeing the light there but as you and i were talking about earlier i mean it ain't gonna be normal no and so we need to and things are starting to settle in with the economy people are getting a little edgy with the you know awesome to be able to get out and do that but people need encouragement i mean they need encouragement that's uh, right like never before and so really that's what this is just goofy i mean i love being goofy with you especially i think we have fun together but it's good for us to laugh 
in the midst of crisis and challenge, but there's a lot that are going through a lot of tough stuff. And I never, I don't want to minimize that in any way. Um, and I know that it's getting even more challenging. You know, a lot of pastors I was chatting with, uh, you know, just trying to wrestle with when to open all this stuff. It's just heavy, a lot of heavy stuff. So this is an opportunity for us to shout out encouragement to others. So we've already met, hit our 10 minute mark. So we're already late, you know, but we're going to do this in one minute, Tom. Yeah. Yeah, I want us. You want to go first? You want to do this? You want to go first? What? Hey, you. Yeah, th why don't you do a couple? Okay, you do a couple. You start. Yeah, you I want me to do a I couple? Think, I, I thought we're just gonna do one minute. Like you do a minute and I do a minute. Okay. Well, look, I'm I'm game. I'm ready. I'm I'm ready. I'm ready for rapid fire. I've got you them all. Rip, you can rip down the rapid fire right oh, now. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So got, this is what you're gonna do. I want you to give just a minute. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da boom. I'm timing you, and then you time me. Uh, and so, oh my gosh, I don't even have my timer on, so I'm gonna have to go close. Hey, it's okay. No, I got it. I got it. I'm ready. Yeah. You don't All right. Even, you don't even need to tell me, bro. I got it. Okay. I got it. Do okay. it. Well, Do it. Shout out. Okay. We're the day after Mother's Day, so obviously I got to start with my mom, Carla Putnam. Yeah, I got to give a shout out to my mom, Carla Putnam, who's not on Facebook, but I got a shout out to her. Uh, uh, I got a shout out to the other most important mom in my life, and that's my wife, Laura. Okay. You know, that's, that is, uh, that's two. Um, uh, I got two, two guys that I want to thank, um, shout out appreciation for Reed DeVries and Alan Keys, both tremendous mentors to mine in ministry and in life as men, really thankful for them. Ken Bayshore, okay. Ken Bayshore, he is one of the, the restaurant owners. Uh, he, we ate in his restaurant on Friday and I just Ooh. am so appreciative of Ken just to know that he's doing everything that he can to reopen in a safe way and earn Sioux Falls trust. I'm so thankful for him. And then finally, I want to thank two guys that are really helpful, like helping me in my workout regimen. And that's Vin Diesel and The Rock, Dwayne, Dwayne Johnson. I mean, obviously by looking at me, I mean, it's all under this vest right now, but I mean, mm. th th my, my workouts are really fashioned after them. Yeah, you truly, you truly. And I, I am so glad as understudies of mine, they have done such good work. I mean, yeah, good it's when, the, when the master sees the student come to such a level like that, that's what it's like for me because the right. influence I've had on those guys. So you're jumping on like, my shout out bandwagon. You're jumping yeah. on my shout out. I am. I was like, like, no. okay, kind of self-serving. Wasn't, wasn't that kind of thanking me? Wasn't that kind of, it was kind of <laughs> you arrogant. You yourself. Yeah, you, yeah. you gave well, yourself a shout out. I've ruined the whole thing. Okay. I have ruined the whole it's, flipping it's your thing. Turn. It's your turn now. Okay, my turn. Here we go. All right. Uh, can you time me? We can't time me. I got it. I got I'm it right get here. here. we go. First, I want to, I want to thank Scott Kerpain. He is a, a songwriter and he's been doing, he does more than I can think, but he wrote this song, You Have Been Good to Me. And it's an oldie. It's like in the 90s, but it's been so, this last week, I've just been listening, listening. Love that song. So thank you, Scott Kerpain. Keep writing music, putting it out there. Uh, I have to say Jennifer Garrick, you know, you have to, you have to see your wife. You did it. I got to eat tonight. Uh, no, yeah. seriously. <laughs> This week, Tom, 34 years ago, 34, 33, 33 years ago, we started dating. Oh, man. So man, she is she a graceful is woman. Uh, she's an amazing woman. And I want to thank her um, for so many reasons. But as a mama, as a wife, and as, a, as a, a woman of virtue. And another woman of virtue, Maxine Marcellini. It's someone you know, actually. You know Maxine. Uh, exactly. Man, all that she has has been through and the way that she writes and that she cares about blended families and families yeah. and she still is you know just a woman of virtue that is i'm seeing all the time i still in contact with and i'm just so grateful maxine for you, you came to my mind this last week dan and joy russell who are ministering in the middle east i'll just say in the middle east right now and dan and joy you know uh you can't give me an email this week and I'm just thinking of you. I mean, just, man, I'm so grateful for you and the love that you're sharing and what you're doing right now. Um, Ernie McNaught, one of my, my first pastors, and uh, he was so gracious. Uh, and he's still, he and Jan are just living out the gospel. And when I pastor now, I think of Ernie and some of the, the things that he's done over the years, and I, I remember them. And that means so much to me 30 years later. Um, I think I'm late, but okay, Solly, Solly and, and Solly Love and Daniel Aarons, my two son-in-laws, I tell you, I was praying for them this last week. I was so grateful that they love my daughters. You know what I mean? That, that they stepped in in a daddy role right now, and then the husband, and I am, and they are loving my daughters. I can't be more grateful for that. And so, guys, I want to thank you for loving my girls and being such great husbands for them. Okay, that's... That that was awesome. Uh, I, oh wait, I, I want to thank you. You broke your own rules. 
Christy <laughs> Nome. I gotta thank Christy Nome. Christy Nome is the the governor of Sioux Falls in oh, South Dakota. Or South Dakota, yeah, South Dakota. Because I've been watching the news, and she opened up the pork plants, and that, that yeah. they're getting my pork. And you can bacon. have bacon now. Yeah, you can have bacon. I can't now. help but yeah. thank her. Oh okay. my gosh. Okay, no, now okay. I, I gotta I gotta evidently go back and read read the rules because I I did not give such great shout outs because I thought I had to hold to a minute, and so I, what did I do? How long did I go? Oh my gosh, just nice. Yeah, you were over oh. two. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. I next with timer. When we get the next technology, we're adding a timer to this. And oh, yes. Ben, who's on the other end. By the way, thanks, Ben. Ben Clifton up, is ben. on here. He's doing all the tech stuff. You can't even see him, but he's helping doing that from a totally different location. Uh, so Ben, thank you. Tom, I love you, buddy. Thanks for hey. let's just keep trying to do this and do this well. And I just love hanging with you, even if it is for 10 minutes or 15 now, 15. Well, on the and, and the deal is, is that we really want to encourage other people to do what we're doing, right? I mean, that's yeah. the, the end of the day. And, and yes, using this, this platform here, but man, don't, don't underestimate the power of an encouraging text today to certain, you know, to people sure. um, or sending an email, uh, you know, a phone call, you know, a phone call of just saying, Hey, I just want to encourage you today and just let you know I appreciate you. Um, just I, I, I'm so thankful that you're in my life or, or whatever. Because again, that is just such a, a, a word that we all need at times in our lives is, is that those words of affirmation. So don't be shy about sending those text messages and emails and phone calls. Good word, Tom. And hey, the, lastly, as we head out from that, the great way to magnify that because that's a personal one and that needs to happen. So keep yep. that up, not as a replacement, but as an addition post your thanks your notes here or a 10 second video just take a video 10 15 seconds throw it up there then tag the person because it's an encouragement to other people so even if you're you're sending it to someone like you're sending it to your mom or whatever it's like man it's an encouragement to other people so it magnifies that that gratitude and can build a little momentum on that so great sure. work Tom. thanks for that buddy hey i Yay! love you we got a cruise uh i mean it's not like we have to cruise but the video by this point you know people are like, oh, these guys there it is ridiculous but uh anyway i love you pal hey let's do uh happy shout out monday everybody happy yeah. shout out monday shout out monday